let's quickly talk about PayPal buy now pay letter so we have a ten thousand dollars easy approval PayPal pay in four no credit check whatsoever don't go anywhere you're gonna love today's conversation I guarantee it Welcome back, folks, to another edition of the Awesome Sweetie Kiwi Show. How are you today? I hope you are doing fantastic. I'm doing marvelous, if you are to ask me. If you are doing as great as I am, go grab a cup of coffee or a tea or vodka and let's roll. <laughs> In today's conversation, I want to talk to you about PayPal Buy Now, Pay Later. It's a great program from PayPal, and you have up to $10,000 easy approval. PayPal Pay in 4, no credit check whatsoever. Let me give you an overview, an overview here. So PayPal Pay is a 4. I mean, PayPal Pay in 4 is actually a payment option that lets you split purchases you make at participating online stores into four payments okay you pay a down payment at the time of sale and then one payment every two weeks for the next six weeks for a total financing period of six weeks so this is really what it is and uh, it's actually paypal's version of buy now pay later that lets you actually uh, take care of your your sale your uh, shopping very very easily what are the pros and cons here the pros you can split purchases into smaller payments and pay over time we love that and millions of online stores accept PayPal payments, we know that, and you can get an instant approval decision. Obviously, this is based on a constellation of factors, including your account history, and there are no fees for paying with the service, and payments are interest-free, okay? What about the cons here? Purchases are limited to $1,500 all the way to $10,000. Now, $10,000 depends on the your account history, but on average, most, most consumers are limited to fifteen hundred dollars okay and paying for is only available at online merchants that accept paypal so you, you need to make sure that the store that you are thinking about buying from does accept paypal and paypal offers fewer repayment options than competitors so this is this is what you have it and one thing you need to understand is that what we love with uh, this program is that paypal has a, a comprehensive FAQ page with answers to common customer service questions. So if you don't find an answer there, you can message PayPal from the FAQ page or call customer service. Okay, and uh, calling is fastest. We have tested it, and if you log into your account first, you need to log into your account first, and uh, you can also call as a guest if you prefer. But it's just a lot better if you have an account and you log into your account first and actually uh, proceed to the questioning uh, phase from there. Okay, and if you want to call them, the number is one eight eight eight. 221-1161 1-888-221-1161 and it's available that the service is available Monday through Saturday 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. Pacific time okay so this is just I just wanted to give you an overview of the program first before getting to the details so let's talk about the process how does pay in four work so to use PayPal's pay in four options the seller must support PayPal payments that's number one okay that means that you can you can use this option at millions of online stores that support paypal and popular missions include best buy targets bed by uh, bed bath and beyond and lens and it really depends okay and so when you check out what will happen here is that you need to choose paypal and select the pay later option so this will let you pick the pay in four way to pay and so you will be given a link to the loan agreements to review and agree to before submitting your application okay you also get an email from paypal with the details of your plan once the purchase is complete okay so when you attempt to check out PayPal will automatically make an approval decision in seconds so you can complete your purchase right away so this is really good okay and to complete your purchase you have to have and this is important to remember you have to pay the first payment you have to make the first payment as a down payment so the rest of the purchase amount is split into three interest-free payments with one due every two weeks this is what it's called the paying for. So you pay, you, you make a, uh, you you make an initial down payment, and then three payments afterwards. And you can manage and make payments either online or via the PayPal app, available on iOS or Android. Okay. And um, one thing I want to say is that to use PayPal and for to use the PayPal Pay and for the program, you need to create a PayPal account and have one in good standing. So once you are ready to check out online or through PayPal's mobile app, you can choose to pay later then select the paying for option so it's important to have a, pay, a paypal account first 
and the account must be in good standing okay so uh, so this is what it is and uh, the approval decision is is instant no need to wait for 24 hours or two weeks or whatever two days whatever you get approved right away okay and let me give you an example let's say if your total is three hundred dollars you will pay seventy five dollars at checkout then you'll have three remaining payments of seventy five dollars due every two weeks until you have paid in full you have paid the, the full amount okay so paypal will not charge interest and payments are automatically billed to the debit credit card or bank account you use to check out and you cannot use your paypal balance to make payments okay so this is something you need to think about and uh, if you pay off your debt early you will not be charged a prepayment fee so paypal is kind of flexible in, in, in that in that respect and unlike some buy now pay later providers PayPal does not charge a late fee for missed payments, but it will contact borrowers with past due accounts. So make sure to read your loan agreements for the full terms and conditions if you fail to repay. Okay, this is very important. Now, let me talk to you about the impact here. So, this is a let's have a conversation about the impact. So, if you are the client for the plan, you can still use PayPal to pay. Okay, I'm not saying you can't use it. It's important to understand that at the end of the day, it's all about how you use the, the account. You'll just need to pick a different payment method from your wallet. That's if you are declined for the plan. And so PayPal will send you an email stating the reason you are declined. Okay, and uh, so the, the good thing about the program is that there are no fees to use pay and for so payments are interest free however paypal may charge a late fee if you are late with the payment depending on your states of residence remember that banking is something that is done at the state level so paypal has a different uh, they have different conditions for different states okay and paypal may perform a soft credit check when you apply for paying for but this will not affect your credit score so they don't do a hard pull here so let's say you are shopping and you're just ready to actually get out of the, your actually you are at checkout and you choose paying for they're not going to do a hard pull they are they will be they'll be doing a soft pull okay so a soft credit check gives the lender in this case a paypal the ability to review your credit uh, credit report and determine credit worthiness okay while this soft credit checks do not affect your credit score they are listed on your credit report okay so the pay in for feature is not currently available to residents of missouri nevada new mexico north dakota rhode island south dakota wisconsin or any u.s territories because as i, as I just told you banking is a state affair so those banks have not allowed paypal to run the service there okay and you must be of legal age in your state to use the service so it can be 18 years old or 19 or 21 this is important and so let's have a quick conversation a quick comparison between paypal pay and for versus paypal credit so if you are making a pricier purchase like a round trip plane ticket somewhere exotic or a fancy new bed PayPal credit is likely a better option, okay? You'll get a reusable credit line and have six months to pay it off. So if you have purchases of $99 or more, and you will not pay interest if you make your payments on time with PayPal credit. However, interest will be charged to your account if you're late. So this is important. So the APR for new accounts is 23.99% and late fees are up to $40. This is important. So this is the big difference here. So while we can't find mention of whether late payments impact your credit score, we know for a fact, and we that we have done research about this, we know that PayPal credit reports, they will report to Equifax, Experian, and TransUnion. So it's possible that your credit score could be affected either negatively or positively based on the timeliness of your payments so it's all about being financially responsible here okay i want to talk to you about benefits folks so the big question is should you use paypal pay in four well that's a personal question it depends on your finances it depends on uh, the shopping it depends on the amount that you want to finance remember that paypal pay in four can go all the way to fifteen hundred dollars However, we have seen people get approved for $10,000. It's all about your history with PayPal. It's all about the, the states you are applying from, okay? So PayPal paying for is available for online shopping at major retailers, okay? And uh, so this could be a great option for you. It depends on, again, it depends on your finances, it depends on your family's finances, uh, on your spending patterns, okay? How financially responsible you are. And so if you are new to buy now, pay later, it's, it's important to understand that you need to have 
you need to already have a PayPal account. Okay, and once you have it, if you want to fund a necessary purchase with a pay later plan, the paying for is a great choice. It's a very simple choice, not complicated. And this is kind of cool also if you don't qualify for a credit card. Okay, so qualifying for pay, a PayPal paying for plan could be easier than qualifying for a credit card. Okay, though PayPal may conduct a soft credit pool, it also considers your history with a company. And you also can have a purchase protection. So PayPal extends its purchase prote protection program to some paying for purchases, meaning if you don't receive your item or it differs from its its uh, description, you may qualify for a reimbursement from PayPal. Okay, and so this feature is unique to BNPL providers. This is really good. And so one thing I need to say right off the bat is this is very important. PayPal paying for is not a good idea if you have a hard time following a budget. I've said this before. Financial responsibility is key. Whether you get a credit card or you have a, you are eligible for the PayPal paying for plan, you need to have financial responsibility. You need to follow a budget, okay? BNPL plans can encourage overspending since you pay less at checkout. It, it, this could be very tempting to fill up your card with more things. So if you struggle with overspending, you want to stick with paying. You want to stick to paying with cash, okay? And if you want to shop in store. PayPal offers its paying for plan online and through its mobile app only. So other uh, buy pay later providers like uh, Affirm and Zip offer plans that are available online and in stores. But with PayPal, it, this can only be this can only happen online. OK. Let us talk about eligibility, folks. Obviously, you are interested in this program. You are thinking about it, and uh, you gotta have you gotta have uh, you gotta meet a few requirements. So, PayPal is offering the paying for plan to a growing number of U.S. customers. So, the plan right now is only available in the states. Okay, and there are a few eligibility requirements. So, availability will depend first and foremost on your states. Okay, because uh, states have different uh, banking banking regulations, and you must be at least 18 years of age to qualify for it, the paying for program, and your PayPal account must be open and in good standing. Good standing is is really important. In other words, you must not have violated any PayPal uh, terms and conditions. Okay, so currently PayPal offers uh, paying for in all states except except as I said before, you have Missouri, New Mexico, Nevada, North Dakota. Uh, Wisconsin and the U.S. territories. Okay. However, one thing we have seen from our research is that not everyone gets approved. So approval depends on PayPal's internal checks and the soft check of your credit score. Okay. It's important, and you also need to understand that you can use pay in for at merchants that accept PayPal payments and in any supported currency, and PayPal will automatically convert the purchase amount to, into U.S. dollars during the checkout process. There are also purchase amounts limits. For paying for, in other words, you can only use this payment method for transaction amounts between thirty and fifty thirty dollars and fifteen hundred dollars. But again, if you have a large transactional history with the PayPal, they can go the approval amount can go all the way to ten thousand dollars. But this is uh, exceptional, okay. And one thing you also need to understand is that uh, PayPal does not allow paying for for certain recurring subscription services, according to the PayPal website. And availability depends on the merchant. So this is something that you need to think about, and we'll love the fact that paying for is um, is a great great program, and you can pay off a paying for plan early. So when you start a paying for plan, you pay the first payments at the time of purchase, right? This is kind of this is very easy to, to understand. So to see your remaining payments, you can log into the website or PayPal app to view your account summary, and your account summary will show you your total purchases and their dates. How many payments you have made and your total payments to date so this is pretty clear it will also show you your remaining your uh, remaining balance and the date and amount of your next payment due the thing is, from there you can make an extra payment or pay off the entire balance early and what we love here is that there are no penalties or additional fees to pay to pay off the the loan early this is really good so any extra payments are applied and displayed in your plan activity immediately i'll be right back but after this don't go anywhere
Welcome back, folks, to another edition of the Awesome Sweaty Kiwi Show. I'm still having a conversation with you with PayPal Buy Now Pay Later Plan. It's, this is the Pay In 4. And I just want to talk to you about PayPal Pay In 4 versus some competitors. There are some alternatives to this program. And I just want to do a quick round down of those uh, competitors. So, first, we have uh, Venue. So, whether you're looking for children's toys, top electrical products, new pots, paints for your kitchen, or an outfit for a wedding, Venue is actually great. It's a premium marketplace for you with the buy now, pay later schemes, okay? And with thousands of products across dozens of categories, Venue has a little bit of something for everybody. So this is really good, and we we'll love the fact that uh, they do have great customer experience. And then you have Afterpay. So Afterpay is one of the other popular buy now, pay later websites. So the pro the process stands out. It's uh, the pro the process is very simple. We love the fact that it stands out because of the simplicity, okay? And all you got to do is to browse your desired store online, choose a product, choose Afterpay as uh, your payment method at checkout, and that's it. Your account will be created in an instant. You will then be given the chance to pay in four interest-free installments, which are due every two weeks. And then we have Sezzle. So Sezzle is another site that you can use to make shopping easier for you. Similar to Afterpay, they also offer simple interest-free payments in installments. The difference is that they break down the, the total cost of your purchase into smaller payments, then spread it across six weeks. Okay, so as low as 25% is due upon purchase, and the remaining amount will be spread out equally in typically three payments of two weeks apart. This is really good. And we have a PayPal credit. I just... Uh, you know talk about that so paypal credit is kind of cool it's uh, basically if you are thinking about spending a lot of money on um if, if you want if you are looking for a larger payment and instead of uh, six weeks you want to pay over six months for example then you want to consider paypal credit and then we have a firm so a firm is a, a buy now pay later uh, mobile app that's available on both android and uh iOS and you can get exclusive offers of 0% APR with the app so this is really good they work similarly to uh, buy now pay later okay and uh, we they, they were similarly to other buy now pay later apps and we love also the fact that they have excellent customer service and then we have zip so zip is a buy now pay later application that you can conveniently use on either Android or iPhone and they do the same thing they allow you to pay to make a payments over six weeks and if you are 18 years or, or 18 years or older they will qualify you i want also want to talk to you about split it so split it is another alternative so uh, they are a merchant a payment method uh, a payment uh, method solutions the solution that enables you to pay your purchases using your credit card by segregating the cost into fees and interest-free monthly payments okay and we love the fact that uh, you don't need to register you don't need to uh, apply for anything so this is good and you can use uh, either your credit or debit with some merchants only accepting the former okay and we have via bill so via bills process does not reinvent the wheel that much there are just subtle differences to it so perhaps a significant difference in our view is how they do things they will not do any credit score check and your loan will be instantly approved upon checkout okay so you'll be asked to pay 25 percent of your total purchase then the first 25 percent per succeeding months this is really good and we have pair pay so pair pay out to actually is another um it's another buy now pay later app okay also they have great customer service and it's all about the store that you are shopping at it's all about the options that you have at checkouts okay i'm giving you all these alternatives to say that if you don't qualify for paypal paying for there are other similar alternatives out there there's similar players out there that you might want you might want to consider and then we have zebit so zebit will only require you to fill out a quick application form before getting approved or yeah, and the, what we love is that the application takes about two to three minutes. So you need to have time. And but the good thing is that Zebit gives its customers a line of credit of twenty five hundred dollars, and they have a Zebit score system that will determine your standing within the app. So, and uh, this is kind of good. And one thing we need to also say is that Zebit will need to validate your identity and income, but will not need your FICO score. You just need to be eighteen years old and above to uh, to actually avail of other services. And then we have Bread. So Bread promises a fast and easy online financing transactions in seconds. So this is really good. We love the fact that they are very uh, flexible. And you also have Partially. So Partially works a little bit differently. So this is a platform that offers you a merchant 
so if you're a merchant, it offers you the chance for your client to have automated payment plans. So it is a way to streamline your invoicing, control your collections, and improve your cash flow, okay? And this is really good. And we have Fingerhut. So with Fingerhut, you basically, this is a credit account. It's kind of similar to a credit card. The only thing is you can buy from their, you can only buy from their site, from their website, okay? And it is one of the most popular options and has been helping people buy stuff easily than um, for the last uh, 10 years, okay? And we love the, the thing is that they do have experience. And Fingerhut covers a wide range of products from beddings to electronic devices, okay? And one thing you need to understand is that they are best known as the go-to buy now, pay later provider or those who have poor credit scores. All right, folks, this is it for today's conversation. I was talking to you about PayPal buy now, pay later scheme. You can get approved for you can get approval for an amount that goes all the way to ten thousand dollars. But more generally, people will qualify for a maximum amount of fifteen hundred dollars. OK, and uh, I spoke to you about it. I gave you an overview. I spoke about the process, the impact, the benefits, eligibility, and I gave you some alternatives. Thank you so much for your attention, folks. I really appreciate it. I'll see you next time. But until then, remember, stay marvelous. <music>